we are happy to represent this, actually to restage this work 30 years after, uh, because we are having uh, an exhibition that we organized on the 80s on the role of commerce, marketing and media in uh, shaping the mentalities and, and the culture of the 80s. And it seemed to us the, the great occasion, a perfect occasion to restage this work that speaks about the power of media, um, the, the fundamental choices between uh, policies of life and policies of death, of violence, of grieving, of communities uh, coming together in various ways. Um, and so Wadishko's work uh, still is relevant today and as much as it is a piece, a seminal piece of art history, gun, the candle, microphones, the media, power of media to shape uh, culture, opinion, and sway people in one way or the other. Um, 30 years after, uh, we've lost and forgotten about the, the original context, but these objects and these symbols still relate to us, still mean a lot of things. In 1988, um, and the artist made it very clear, it had as a pointed reference to the, the politics and the issues that were at the forefront of public debate. This was, was an election year in the States. Um, and uh, But 30 years ago, uh, these symbols, the gun, the cattle, the mics, take on different meanings. It's a very rich work because even 30 years after, even when the context of its creation is, has, has, you know, has disappeared, has totally changed, it's still relevant in, in very open ways and uh, people will relate to this work in, in various ways depending on how they, they perceive these symbols.